Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Let me ask you something. Have you ever lost an important file? A document, a family photo, a project you were working on, and thought it was gone forever? Whether it was a system crash, accidental deletion, formatting, or even a corrupted external drive. Losing data is one of the most frustrating experiences any of us can face. But what if I told you there's a way to bring that data back? Safely, easily, and without spending a fortune? In today's video, I'm going to show you an in-depth look at 4DDIG Windows Data Recovery Software, a tool that promises to help you recover over 2,000 file types from various storage devices. And yes, up to 2 gigabytes for free. We'll walk through how it works, test it on a real recovery scenario, and see if it really lives up to the hype. So whether you're just curious in a panic over lost files or looking for a good recovery option, you know, you're in the right place. Right. First, download the 4DDIG Windows Data Recovery software. The link is in the description below. As soon as you install and open it, you'll see an interface like this. On the left side, you'll see different recovery options like hard drive, recover lost files from internal or external hard drives, SD card, recover data from memory cards, camera, phone, etc. Video recovery, specialized mode to recover deleted or lost videos. Cloud drive, restore files from connected cloud storage if supported. Crashed PC, create bootable media to recover data from a system that won't start. Video sock photo repair, repair corrupted videos or images. Toolbox, additional recovery and repair tools. In the middle section of the screen, you'll see all the storage devices connected to your computer, including your local drives like C and D, any external USB drives and additional, options like Recycle Bin, Select Folder, and Windows Backup. From here, you can simply select where you want to recover data from. All right, let's get started with the real test. I've selected and permanently deleted a few different types of files from my computer, including images, audio files, videos, a PDF document, and even a Word file. These aren't just in the recycle bin. I've emptied that too, so the data is completely gone from the system. Now we'll see if 4DDIG Data Recovery can actually scan the drive and recover these files successfully. Let's jump into it. Now I'm clicking on the Select Folder option, and from here, I'll choose the specific folder where I had deleted the files earlier. This allows the software to scan only that location which saves time and makes the recovery process faster. Now it asks what type of files you want to recover, like photos, videos, audio, or documents. You can select specific types to speed up the scan or leave everything checked to search for all files. As you can see, the software has started scanning the folder and it's now showing the progress. The scan is complete and it has found several deleted files that we can recover. As you can see, I've opened one of the pictures that was previously deleted. And yes, the software has successfully recovered it. Now it gives me the option to either select all or manually choose which files I want to recover. Once I've selected the files I want to recover, I just click on the Recover button at the bottom. Now it asks me to choose a location to save the recovered files. As you can see, the recovered data has been successfully saved in the folder I selected earlier. All the files, including the pictures, videos, documents, and audio that I had permanently deleted, are now back and fully accessible. I can open them without any issue and they're working just like before. So that's how you can easily recover permanently deleted files using 4DDIG data recovery, whether it's photos, videos, documents, or anything else. This tool really makes it simple. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment if you have any questions. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.